We understand the challenges that are facing this business and that are facing our members. We've understood that all along. What we want is modernisation by consent. We want it done in a way that aligns the interests of postal workers, of our customers and the company. But we do have to say to the government tonight that in understanding those challenges, we still have the outstanding problem of pensions. And we have to be honest and say that unless this government is going to move that debate forward, and we hope they'll do it in a positive way, and we want to take part in positive dialogue with the government now, uh, unless we actually deal with that issue, those challenges are going to be very difficult to overcome just by Royal Mail and ourselves. So we're pleased with the agreement that's been reached. We know that there's a lot of hard work that still remains, and we're committed to doing that in a way that can ensure uh, the service is restored properly. Uh, and we're pleased that our members will now be able to get back to working normally. Uh, we know how difficult it's going to be for them, and we're going to give them our full support in achieving that aim.